Well, it sounds a bit strange to say it. Results are important. Of course they are. But, but you know, we, we know United are not going to be in a league title race. But there's a push for the top four, obviously, and it is important. But I think results don't just bring you longevity. I, I think it's important that Ten Hag sees the little things that he's doing on the training field, the things that he's telling the players, for them to take it on the park. Anybody can lose a game. Anybody can make a mistake and somebody scores a wonder goal. But I don't want to see United been outplayed by Brentford. I want to see the things that I didn't see from Ralph Ranić. I want to see the changes. I want to see the pressing. I want to see the shape, the defending, the passing out from the back, the patterns of play. And if they don't get the result, but he, he's getting those things, that, in some sense, is a plus point. But if he's not getting the result and he's not getting those things, that's a worry because we know Ranić got no tune out of him. It looked no different. There was no pressing. There was nothing. And I think it's important, even this early on, that they go to Brentford and they puff their chests out and we see a bit of the Eric Ten Hag team, even if it's not all his players and the players he wants. But we see a little mirror image of what he wants on the field. It might not be perfection, but it at least gives him something tangible to work on. And I think that is almost as important as the result at the weekend. That he has to see the stuff that he's working on from Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, taken onto the field at the weekend. Because if he doesn't, that's a real head scratcher for a coach. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+.